Hey Derek and Rosalyn, it's Natalia. I'm here at Edgewater 442. This is the front door right when you walk in. And everything in here is super adorable. Got this nice tray ceiling up here in the entrance with a really cute modern looking fixture. And so to the right's the kitchen and the um, living room. To the left, it looks like all the bedrooms are gonna be down there. Uh, I did have to come over here a little early because they had a snowboard bird coming in. Oh, that's that. Coming in tomorrow. So I had to come on over here today. Where's the light for the kitchen? Oh, there we go, okay. So we've got, feels like Corian to me. It's not granite. It's just got those rounded, I don't think it's granite. It seems like a Corian. But really nice cabinets. Okay. Good fixtures. That's really pretty up there with the crowning on the top of the cabinets. Um, this is a scraped ceiling, so that's rare and time consuming to do. Um, I'm not sure if the other ones we saw did have that. So we got the fridge in here. Looks lovely to me. Everything's super good and clean because there's renters coming in here, like I said. So here's your little breakfast nook. So that back out there is the parking lot and the golf course over on this side. And I'm trying not to walk too much on the carpets because they do have it all nicely vacuumed. And they said to try to not make footprints or if I did to mark them out because the renters don't like other people in here and they can tell when there's footprints in the fresh carpet. Looks like there's a bedroom back there though. So we've got all this in here. Lots of nice windows, gorgeous little porch out there. They've got two sofas in here, nice dining table. So we're gonna keep on going. So your view is awesome out there. You can't see the, the tea box or the hole, but it's really cute. So we're gonna walk back into, so the master is on this side, but the, probably the, the larger master. So again, a view of the golf course out of these nice big windows. Great tray ceiling in here as well. They do have a nice ceiling out in the living room. I forgot to show you. It's not the same, but it's neat. It is good to be up on this fourth floor. You get a, a higher ceiling than the others, it seems. So back into the bedroom here. Let's walk back in here. That's not the light. So this door on the left, it's probably an owner's closet back in there, but it is locked. So then we've got this one in here. Good size closet. And I have not seen not one like cosmetic issue or anything weird. Oh. There is one thing, there's a teeny tiny, not teeny tiny crack in the paint, but that's probably just because, you know, settling and things like that happen over time, but that should not be a big deal. I do want to point that out though. The carpet is in really good condition. Um, so let me turn this light back on. I don't see any like big stains or anything like that. Got enough room for a big dresser in here. And so let's go back into this master bath. So we've got vanity on this side. 
nice shower, large soaking tub, your little toilet area, and another vanity. So really good size, nice tree ceiling up in here too. So super adorable. Like I said, that this is on a rental, so they've got all their soaps and stuff out. But, all right. So let's go on back in through the master. And we're gonna go over to the other side. I wanna get that view again, super pretty. It's wet out here, I would step out, but I'll at least open the door. It's been raining nonstop. So, nice ceiling fan up there too. That's really good to have in the summer. It is screened, so super great. Oh, so that is the, down there past that tree is where um, the hole is. So, all right. And so we're gonna go back through the kitchen. And like I said again, no stains on the carpet. It looks really good. None over here either. I actually don't know if I showed this side. So we've got this over here. We've got a dishwasher to the right of the sink. Nice good size sink in here. Looks like this would be a garbage disposal. Let's see. Oh yeah, that's a garbage disposal. And then so your view right into the living room. Nice open concept. Closet right here when you walk in. Oh, this is your washer and dryer. Oh, look at that. So that's nice. Got a little closet back here. And that's just your HVAC. And your water heater's back in there. Your panel. Okay. Those are really good looking washer and dryers. Maytag. I don't know a whole lot about appliances, but I think that's a good brand. <laughs> So back into our little front entryway. Now we're going to the other two bedrooms. First, uh, this is just a humongous closet. It's not attached to a room. Just a nice big storage room. Then we go back here. Another super cute ceiling in here with the crown molding. So we've got our off suite bedroom and bathroom. So there's all that. So then back into the hallway. So then we've got our bedroom in here with the two twins that would use that bathroom. Nice good size dresser. It's not tight on the sides with two twins on here, but it, this space right here is a little tight. I mean, I can fit through it, but just something to point out. Still can kind of see the golf course from in this room. Super adorable. Nice big size closet right here. Right. And we have our second, well, this is humongous. Beautiful ceiling in here. We have one closet right in here. So yeah, this, this is two masters. So we have a nice humongous closet. Y'all might want to move here full time. <laughs> Enough for two queen sized beds and that big dresser in between. Nice big dresser over here. And still tons of room here. You could have like a whole other sitting area in here. Oh my goodness. So this seems like more of the master, even though it doesn't have the golf course view, but you have this whole humongous closet in here. 
So, golf course view or humongous closet. You get to pick. <laughs> By myself and I'm making myself laugh. Oh, yeah. And so, this is the exact same layout in the bathroom. Same size shower, same size tub, same vanities, same toilet. So, y'all were 100% correct with two masters. Let me go back out into the living room one last time. Just to walk you through the layout again. So I'm coming out of the second master. Bathroom's on the right. Second bedroom's in here. Third, just storage closet. Back into the entryway, which is super cute. Washer and dryer. Kitchen and breakfast nook. Living room, dining. And your second master is way back there on the golf course. So I hope this helps. Y'all reach out if you have any questions, but everything is in excellent shape. I see not a single ding on the wall or dent. It's, it's a really good looking, good looking unit. So, oh, I forgot about this door here. I'm gonna guess pantry. Look at that. Wonderful. Alrighty. Well, I look forward to hearing from y'all. Um, it's been nice and ugly in Myrtle Beach, so I'm glad y'all didn't make a trip for anything. I hope this video is super clear and that it didn't leave any questions out or areas that we didn't see. So y'all let me know what you think.